Hey everybody, it's Kyle. Uh, looks like my camera's crooked. A little bit better. Anyway, hey, uh, I wanted to share with you something that happened yesterday. You know, I post videos pretty regularly and I got a, a nasty email yesterday. Somebody didn't like what I said on one of my videos. And they weren't, they weren't just unhappy. They were furious because it was like a three paragraph email tell me how horrible and terrible I was <laughs> and uh, obviously it tickled me and uh, I was like sitting next to my wife on the couch we were just watching TV and I was just reviewing my emails which you know we do that sometimes as we sit next to each other and I started giggling and my wife said why are you laughing I said somebody just sent me a really nasty email and so she wanted to read it and I said no I don't think you want to read it it's not very nice and she said I want to read it what would they say well she read it and it kind of upset her and she asked me why I was laughing about it why it didn't upset me and you know the truth is I think uh, I guess if you're not upsetting somebody you're probably not saying anything worth hearing so maybe for me it was just uh, uh, I felt like it was a it let me know that people were actually maybe even watching the videos but that there was people that disagree with my opinions and that's okay I don't really have a problem with that um, but, it, but it also reminded me of uh, one of my favorite guys in the world uh, and it's a guy by the name of Charles Barkley he used to be an NBA player now he's an NBA analyst and he says the craziest stuff and He's really funny, but he says some really controversial stuff. And a few years back, quite a few years back, when he was, I think, still in the NBA, he wrote a book. And um, in the book, he said, and I'll never forget when I read it because it made me laugh. It said, half the world is going to love you and half the world's going to hate you. So let the lovers love and let the haters hate and be yourself and it, and it was kind of interesting to me I, it, it kind of freed me up a little bit to be myself you know I've always been the kind of guy that doesn't really want to upset people too bad um, but sometimes people are going to be upset at you if you share your opinions and you have to be okay with that you have to be confident in your opinions and confident in what you say so now what I'm not saying is, don't get this wrong, if you're just nasty all the time, half the world's not going to love you and half the world's not going to hate you. Maybe it's closer to 80% hate you if you're just nasty all the time. And there's people like that, you know them. But, uh, you know, the idea that we should be all things to all people, it's really kind of a silly idea, I think. So I guess my challenge to you today is to, to be yourself. There's going to be people that just don't like you, and that's okay. Half the world's going to love you, half the world's going to hate you. So be yourself. Let the lovers love, let the haters hate, and be yourself. So that's my message for today. Uh, but if you're one of those people that's really nasty, you know, maybe try to get closer to 50-50. Maybe be a little nicer. It makes the world a happy place. So that's my message for today. Have a great day, and I'll chat with you tomorrow. Bye-bye.